Hi guys, it's Paige and I'm back with another video. So today I just wanted to talk to you guys about what I think is the most affordable luxury evening bag out there right now. Um, and probably the most affordable luxury bag in general, but particularly when it comes to evening wear or formal wear, I think this is the bag that's going to give you the best value for your money. So if you're interested, keep watching. So the thing about luxury items, you know, you spend a lot of money, so you want to, you know, for most of us, we're gonna get a bag that we're going to make sure that we can use and get our money's worth out of it, right? And so I think for most of us, you know, that's not gonna be an evening bag, um, especially right now. Um, most of us are not going to formal or more dressier occasions on a regular basis. And I think for most of us, our first luxury purchases are going to be bags that are more practical, bags that we can get more use out of, but they're not necessarily bags that are designed or even really appropriate to be worn um, in more formal or dressier occasions. So the bag that I want to talk to you guys about today is a Saint Laurent bag and it is called the Saint Laurent Uptown Pouch. Now this is a bag that was really designed to be a part of another bag, um, but it really works on its own. Um, so this is the packaging that it comes in. Um, you get the box obviously in a dust bag. So I actually have two of these bags. I have one in a light tan color. And then I also have this one. Um, and this is the first one that I bought, which is in a mock crock and it has silver hardware opposed to the um, gold hardware in these. Um, so initially when I was thinking about, well, purchasing an evening bag, it was because, you know, like I explained before, um, I had all these nice bags, but when it was time for me to go to a more formal or dressier, um, occasion, I just didn't really have a bag that was appropriate, um, for, that really worked for that occasion. Um, but you know, it kind of seemed silly to me that I would wear, you know, cheaper bags for more important or dressier occasions. And then I had more expensive bags for casual everyday wear. Um, so I was looking to purchase another bag over the summer. Um, but I also didn't want to spend a lot of money on a bag that I may use once per year or maybe I just don't use it as often and so that's when I found out about this bag in particular um, and, and this one I think is most appropriate for evening wear so these bags you know I have them in two different colors but they come in several different colors um, and they come in with different leathers so this one is the pebble leather this is the mock crop but they also have it in a shiny smooth leather and they come in a variety of colors um, most of them coming with the gold hardware um, but there are a couple that come with silver hardware and I think it's mostly in the mock crock. I think all if not um, all of them may be in the silver hardware but they did recently come out with a black mock crock with gold hardware um, which I think these bags are more you know they're still not cheap but they're more affordable um, than the other bags where you can you know you won't feel too bad about purchasing more than one um so this bag right here in the smooth leather one they retail for $5.45 and there was a recent price increase because they were $4.75 um, but sometime I think around the end of the summer they um you know the price went up and this one is now $6.25. It was for $5.45. Um, so I think in you know, considering the prices, especially now of many luxury items, um, you know, this is you know a, a better deal compared to some alternatives. 
So the thing that makes these bags an even better buy is that there definitely are ways that you can get these bags for even cheaper than their retail value. So um, I actually got this bag for $380 opposed to $545. And I got this bag for $545 opposed to $625. So I purchased both of these bags from Selfridges, which is a UK department store. And um, for whatever reason, they have these bags listed at prices that are lower than their regular US value um, or retail value. Um, and you know, it's hit or miss and the prices fluctuate. So for example, um, this bag is in stock on their website for $500. And this bag is on their website right now um, you know, at the time that I'm recording this video for $450 opposed to $545. Um, and so, you know, the bags go in and out of stock and you never know what, you know, um, colors they may have. And I believe there are other websites that you may be able to find um, these bags at cheaper um prices um but i've been seeing these bags on other sites like i've seen this bag in red um on joma shop for 625 or something that's higher than its actual retail value um so i think that just you know goes to show that um you know consider you know for what it is um being a luxury item it's at a pretty decent price point and i wouldn't be surprised um, if the prices go up another time. So I just wanted to quickly compare them. I don't have the smooth leather one, but I definitely um, rich, wish that I did. Um, so I'm going to compare them and show you what you can fit in them, which really isn't a whole lot. Um, but like I said, for what it is, um, it does the job. Um, so first I'm going to show you the mock croc one. You know, it has smooth or I'm sorry, a shiny finish. Um, the This version of the bag is pretty s stiff. As you can see, it's extremely thin. Um, and, it, you know, this one is, you know, a little bit more difficult to open. Um, this bag is softer um, because of the type of leather that it has. Of course, it's still very thin, um, but it has more give. Um, so this bag, you actually can fit more um, than you can in this bag, but you still can fit um, quite a bit. So I'm going to, I'll actually just stuff this one since it's the stiffer bag and show you what can fit in it. All right, so I am going to put a few items in here. Um, I'm using an old cell phone because I'm recording with mine. Um, I have a key holder. Um, a card case and a lipstick, a lip gloss, and a Saint Laurent travel size perfume. So I'll let you know um, what you can put in there, um, which I think are pretty much the basics of you know what you would need on a night out. Um, so I've put my key holder down here um horizontally and i have the cell phone on the side um then i'm gonna put my card holder in here vertically well if i can and then i have the perfume and i'm just gonna put the lipstick in here and as you can see, it closes. Um, I'll to try to show you how it fits in there. Um, you have to be careful not to overstuff the bag. Um, otherwise, you know, it closes with a magnetic closure. Um, so if you overstuff it, you have too many things, it's not going to close. And then, you know, you risk your things falling out. Um, with this other bag, like I said, you can definitely stuff a lot more. Um, like I have AirPods right here. Um, I don't think that I could really stuff these in here um, and, and close it. You know, you can squeeze it in here, but it, it's not going to close. So 
you know, basically, obviously you guys won't have the same stuff that I have, um, but you're going to have to, you definitely can't pack everything with you. You only can take the bare necessities, um, which, you know, is why this bag is not necessarily practical. It's only really good for, you know, when you're going out or maybe if you're going to dinner or a lunch or something um, and basically you're trying to be cute, not, you know, if you're trying to find something that's practical and you're going to be able to take all the things you may need. Um, so that is really all I have to share about these clutches. Um, thank you to everybody who subscribed so far and liked or commented on any of my videos. I appreciate you guys for watching and in the comments below, let me know what you think um, about these bags. Have you heard of them? Um, have you tried it? Um, what's your opinion on it? And what's the best luxury evening bag, you know, in your opinion? All right, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.